What's going on guys, Stefan here. Welcome to another video. And oh man, is it a good day today. For the first time in four months, we have full contact, full team training, no restrictions. Yeah, so I think the last time we had full team training was the first week of March, because it was three weeks before our opening game. And then obviously at that point, everything's shut down. We've had small group training, we've had individual training. More recently, we've been doing groups of 10, but still no contact, but today, June 28th, 29th, whatever this Monday is, is the first day of full contact team training. And I am beyond excited for that. It's about time. But it's eight in the morning right now. I'm just going for a little walk. I normally do this in the morning for about 15 minutes just to get my legs loose. And then I'll go back to the apartment, stretch a little bit before we actually start training at nine o'clock. So finishing up my walk, leave at 8.30, and then head off to the training ground and training at 9 a.m. Just got home from the first session, finally back in full team training. It went really well today. It was awesome to get everybody back on the pitch, defending each other, tackling each other. There's a big difference between shadow play, which is kind of what we've been doing the past few weeks, or just doing patterns, or just drills, to going into a full contact seven-a-side match, especially when everybody is buzzing to get back out there. So it did feel a little bit weird at first, going full contact, but once you get going, it just feels like feels like a normal game again. But everything still isn't back to 100% normal. Even though we're full contact, full team training, no restrictions on that end, 
There's still a lot of stuff we have to do off the pitch that we have to make sure we follow. We got a fresh new pack of masks today that we have to wear anytime we're not on the pitch or training. We got hand sanitizer we have to make sure we use all the time. Um, pretty much anytime we're not training, we have a lot of restrictions on us that most other people don't have to deal with right now. So even though Georgia as a state is open, the players of Tormenta FC and the staff, we are pretty much still on lockdown and quarantine. We're not allowed to do a lot of the stuff most other people are allowed to do right now. We're not allowed to leave Statesboro, which is where Torment is located. Got to wear a mask all the time. Not allowed to go out to eat. All that kind of stuff. Whole lot of rules, but once you get on that pitch, everything just feels back to normal. But because we haven't done full team training in almost four months now, we're kind of easing back into it. Today was a little bit of a shorter, easier day. We just started off with a warm-up, a little bit of possession, and then we got into seven aside games, but that was pretty much it for today. It was about an hour, hour, 15 minutes. Hopefully this week we're going to get more into 11v11, and I think this weekend we're going to have our first 11v11 inner squad game for, I think, 45, 60 minutes, something like that. So looking forward to that, but just super excited to be back out on the pitch with everybody again. But I'm going to shower now, get ready for lunch. We're going to leave in about a half hour or so. Oh, and I forgot to talk about this, but testing, basically how we're able to be back in full team training right now. So all of the players, all of the staff got tested early last week. My test was not yesterday, but the Sunday before that. I got my results back on Wednesday or Thursday, I think. So everybody had their results back mid to late that week. Nobody came back positive, which was awesome. So the league pretty much gave us the go ahead to get into full team training. Don't say what's up, boys. What's up? <laughs> Got back from lunch about an hour ago. I've just been chilling here in the apartment, but we have no yoga today, no sports psychology today, no meetings today. So I'm going to take advantage of this time and go to the gym now. My plan for the gym today is I don't want to make it super intense. I'm not going to use a lot of weights. The session I kind of planned in my head is a lot of body weight stuff, some plyos, but not super taxing on the body. Just because we're starting to really get into full team training now, there's a big difference from just running and keeping fit like we've been doing the past few weeks and few months to actually playing. So I'm going to take the first week pretty easy with the gym, just let my body get used to being on the pitch again, full contact, intense training sessions. But, uh, but yeah, that's the plan, so let's head off to the gym now. But that is all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like, drop a comment down below. Subscribe for more videos in the future, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.